Hello everyone, my name is Chris and I'm go in this video I'm going to be talking about how I adapt this robot game, pros and cons of using them, my download, upload, and paint speeds and tips and tricks on using Powerline adapters and most important, how I optimize Powerline adapters for the best performance and lower paint. So without further ado, let's get right into it. A Powerline adapter is using your house electrical wiring to deliver Ethernet. Think of it as your house wiring is a big long Ethernet cable. The only problem with this is your house is pretty old or has some bad wiring, you will not get great speeds at all with power line adapters. My house was built in 1930 and I get adequate speeds with the adapter, but newer homes most likely with the newer technology and stuff, the speeds will most likely be very fast, but older homes the speed will be lower and in some cases be worse than Wi-Fi. Speaking of speeds, I'm going to be showing you the speeds I get with Wi-Fi versus the Powerline adapter, which is advertised for 600 megabit speed on Ethernet. <coughs> These results are pretty interesting. On the Wi-Fi, download speed is over three times faster than Powerline, but upload speed is around the same. While that while download speed is slightly slower on Powerline adapter, the ping is nearly cut in half. Since Fing Man is the most in gaming, it is safe to say that Powerline adapters are slightly better for gaming than Wi-Fi. But Wi-Fi most of the time will be superior while downloading files at high speeds, the results may vary. Once with newer wiring inside, the speeds may be much faster since new electric cables are designed to hold more data and in turn faster speeds. In Fortnite, my ping was at 10 to 15 when using Wi-Fi. In a bland creative world, with the power line, I get an average with 0 to 10 ping, which is a noticeable difference and shows that power line adapters have overall lower ping. Oh my god! Wow! To set up the power line adapter, all you have to do is plug one with an Ethernet cable to your router into the raw outlet and another one in a raw in a outlet to the room where your PC and console is. Make sure you don't plug the power line adapter into an outlet center or a search for technical search. It will make it hard for the power line adapter to find your house physical wiring. And using power, line, power strips or search protectors, your signal could easily be blocked, which will cause your power line adapters to not work correctly or you'll have terrible speeds. Now I'm going to be showing you how to optimize your power line adapter. So you're going to click here, type device manager. And you want to make sure that your Wi-Fi is disabled since this could cause some stuttering issue in your games and uh, you can always enable it like if you want to use Wi-Fi if you try to download a high intensity file that that's going to, that's going to take a long time that your Wi-Fi downloads from maybe it's faster you want to you probably you probably want to still disable it and enable it when you use it and that's the first trick and the second, you press Windows and R keys together, type ncpa.cpl. You want to click your 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 uh your Ethernet, which is your power line adapter. You want to click on Properties. You want to click on Internet Protocol version IP4. Click Properties. Use the following DNS server 1111 and one zero 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 one. And you just want to set your DNS server to get the fastest speeds out your power line adapter using the cloud for your DNS, which is pretty fast. The default ISP DNS is pretty slow, so you're going to be setting this to a pretty fast speed, which is obviously going to increase your speed. So yeah, power line adapters are pretty good for gaming. If wiring a big long Ethernet cable throughout your house is an option, remote code adapters won't work for your house. I think power line adapters are a good alternative to reducing things for games than Wi-Fi. If you found anything in this video useful, it would mean a lot if you leave a like or subscribe. It really helps and means a lot and it's going to help more people get recommended this video. Anyways, peace.